Day two of a bus driver sick out could cause major delays for Cab County students to Cab County students. Once again, we have learned that some of the 350 bus drivers who took part yesterday have been fired. Naima Abdullahi joining us from the bus barn in DeKalb this morning. Naima, I know you saw some drivers rolling out this morning. What's the latest? And Sheba, they're continuing to show up despite the fact that it is expected for this protest to continue into today. Let's show you right now. There are many buses still left in the parking lot. Now, all of this is causing a major impact in one of Metro Atlanta's largest counties with long delays. And this has been a hot topic on the 11 Alive Facebook page. Nancy says fire them. Kids are being put at risk. But Ann says just any old body will not drive buses. Negotiations are needed. We have asked why are drivers protesting? We're told it's for different reasons. The top three being how, how much they're paid, retirement benefits, and how they're allegedly treated in the county. The superintendent is speaking out saying they're using the district's children as bargaining chips, and one driver says uh, he's already been fired. All right, here's the letter I received from the three the Cal County Resource Officers today. You know, I was shocked for three officers to come to my house. I was like, what have I done? My kids at Brackett Elementary School, uh, I would miss them, but I, I talked to the principal and asked her to speak to them for me. And we're also finding out the firing is legal, according to the Georgia Department of Labor. We're going to continue following this into day two to see what today's impact is. Back to you.